crunched into 180, 170 on both tote and fix. So it's the one they want. Green light's been given. We have the starting signal here for the fifth at Murray Bridge. Here comes the lure. Ready. Lids are up, they're away, and Plummer step nicely from the outsider. It's mustering across, going with it. Bidgey Boy, they pair off together. Going to third was He's All Ours. Then Blazing Strings, next was Zag Reb. Back in the field, second last, Jack Knight. Last of all, Linga Lorraine. Up toward the turn, Bidgey Boy said, catch me if you can. Dashed away by three to Plummer. It's all over. Bidgey Boy opening right up. Plummer ran second, third, He's All Ours. Fourth then, Zag Reb, followed by Jack Knight, Alinga Lorraine. And last of all was Blazing Strings. Well, that was an easy watch. Time around 22.2. Market had that spot on. Bidgey Boy made a mess of them in the end. Plummer ran second. Number seven will run third. He's all ours. And six will run fourth. So it'll be 2.876. Time 22.24. Bidgey Boy makes it three from three here at the track in the distance. Just goes so well here. Trained by Lauren Harris and owned by the Integrity Greyhound Syndications, managed by T. Cogger. Career start number 35, win number 10. Well, if you took the odds on, you didn't have much to worry about up towards the turn. Plummer stepped really well, just couldn't get across and uh, head off the favourite Bidgey Boy. I thought for a minute when they jumped that it might be able to, but Bidgey Boy just had too much speed. Plummer ran second, dog by Kinlock Bray out of Zipping Spring. Seven for third. That's He's All Ours for Lisa Rasmussen and, and the six, Zag Reb for John Rees, run fourth. 22-24, 2876 of the numbers. Margins of four and a quarter by one and a half. Easy watch for favourite punters. Winner here, race number five, was the two Bidgey Boy.